In this video, I'm going to talk about how do you raise a customer support ticket with Microsoft if you encounter any product related issues. So take for example, if you're using Dynamics 365 customer service application, uh, I'm in customer service admin center and take for example, if something is not working and you have tried your heart uh, to uh, configure some uh, settings and maybe you think that this is product related issues, uh, then what you can do is like you can raise a ticket with Microsoft. But uh, how do you raise a ticket with Microsoft? So if you see uh, customer service admin center, or maybe if you go to say customer service workspace or maybe customer service hub. So these are the applications which are part of Dynamics 365 customer service application. Now in that application, you may not find a direct way to raise a ticket with Microsoft. Now there is a, uh, if you see here, there is a help, uh, find help and training. But if you click over here, what happens is it will take you to uh, learn.microsoft.com. Okay, so here you may not be able to raise a support ticket. Okay, uh, and same goes with other application as well as even customer service workspace, there is find help and training and customer service hub application again, find help and training. So how do we raise a customer support ticket with Microsoft if you encounter any issue with the product? Okay. Now, uh, let me go into Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Now, Microsoft 365 Admin Center, from here, if you want to raise a support ticket, then on the left navigation, you can navigate to support and click on help and support, okay? Or alternatively, you may find some floating uh, menu over here and you can click on help and support. But remember that whatever ticket you will raise from here, that is only related to Microsoft 365. When you say Microsoft 365 means if you encounter issue with Outlook, OneDrive, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, SharePoint, Teams, those sort of things. Okay. So uh, if you encounter any Dynamics 365 related issue, then uh, uh, this is not the right place to raise a customer support ticket. So Microsoft 365 Admin Center is ruled out. So if you want to raise something in Dynamics 365, then what you need to do is like navigate to Power Platform Admin Center. So the URL is admin.powerplatform.microsoft.com. Now on the left menu, you will see something called as help and support. So if you click on help and support, then here you will see support request and the known issues. Okay. Now there is a button which says get help plus support. So if you click on plus get help plus support, then you need to uh, specify some parameters you need to mention what product were you using when this issue occurred so uh, there is a wide plethora of uh, uh, applications which you can see all related to dynamics 365 so there is dynamics 365 business central commerce customer insights customer voice field service finance guides layout now uh, for me it is either dynamics 365 omni channel for customer service or dynamics 365 customer service now this list is comprehensive okay and you can see whole bunch of information so if it is just specific to dataverse then you can select microsoft dataverse or power pages or power bi or power automate but what i'm going to do is i'm going to just select dynamics 365 customer service now this is the product what which environment are you encountering issue with so i might say it's related to customer service trial and tell us what you need help with so maybe i'll just say um, enhanced uh, routing is not working okay so just for an example okay so then it will start giving you some suggestions if uh, uh, if the suggestion matches with your uh, request, then you can uh, select those, okay? So not able to en en enable unified routing. So if I type in this, then, uh, and then I can click on here, it will search for recommended solutions, okay? Now, if you see under solutions, it will say that, okay, this is the known issue. This is the recommended solutions. Uh, maybe it is something related to, Dynamics 365 licensing and all those things. But if you think the solution is not helpful, okay, then you can click on next. And from here, support plan information will come up. So support plan. If you have any Microsoft 365 support plan, then you can uh, add those as a new contract or you just select Dynamics online. 
and then from here you need to mention some more information like uh, you can say that i'm unable to maybe find routing and put some more uh, description you can say uh, you can select when did the issue start what time it was maybe i'll just say it was uh, 5 a.m in the morning and uh, time zone maybe i'll just say utc plus 10 brisbane and is the problem you're reporting related to recent service change i'm not sure i'll say not applicable how severe is the issue me i'll just say it's a minimal impact if i have any attachment i can attach over here and then allow access to advanced diagnostic information without the creation of support environment so maybe i'll just give microsoft access or if you do not want to give uh, Microsoft access to the diagnostic information, then you can select do not allow access to diagnostic information. Now, once you click on next, it will ask you for more information, which country, your email address, phone number, best way to reach you. So maybe I'll just my email address and I can put my phone number. Okay, And best way to reach, I'll say email and i can click on submit so i'm not going to do this because I, this is not like a, a real issue but i'm just showing you how to raise a customer support ticket so that's it folks this is all about raising customer support ticket in dynamics 365 customer service and once you raise a ticket let me show you once you raise a ticket you can go to known issues over here and then you can click on product category if there are any known issues pertaining to the applications uh, you see over here. So Microsoft recently like posts most of the issues of the product uh, with regards to product and current status. Those all things get uh, registered over here. So it's a nice uh, information for you to have a look into like if there are any product related outstanding issues which Microsoft is currently worked on working on. So support request, this is the place where whatever ticket you have raised, it will be registered over here. So I have raised one ticket and that's why you can see over here. So that's it, folks. This is how you raise a customer support ticket in Power Platform Admin Center. Thanks for watching.